Well, if you drive down Garner's Ferry Road, you'll see construction is underway at Columbia's VA Hospital. Rachel Ripp shares the details of the project and the expanded services that will soon be available. A hard hat zone sits catty corner to the Dorn VA Medical Center, and it's been there for some time now. But change is in motion. Four new buildings and a walking path are coming soon, one of which will be open this summer. In the next uh, several months, we'll be using again for primary care. We'll have 40 individual treatment rooms. Uh, we will have three stories of services, and it'll provide 25,000 square feet of space for us to provide primary care spaces for veterans across the state. Another building designed for post-surgery recovery breaks ground next week, set to be finished in a year. You might ask, why all these new buildings? It boils down to serving the local veteran population who rely on the VA for services. In the last five years, the Dorn VA Medical Center has added 1,000 new staff members. We will be doubling in size down the road. Um, the future is very bright. Uh, we, we're growing by leaps and bounds every year. Right now, uh, we have a projection of 89,000 veterans that we will treat. Uh, daily, uh, we provide about 3,300 outpatient services. And to this team at the VA, care is important. The reason why we have VAs across the nation is because we have many men and women who have put their lives on the line for, for all of us. Reporting in Columbia, Rachel Ripp, News 19, WLTX. We're being told construction for every new building and the walking path will all be in the works by summer of next year.